In the 1960s, a bold idea began to take shape at NASA. Scientists and engineers realized a rare alignment of uh, planets would soon occur. This alignment would allow a spacecraft to visit all four gas giants, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Thus, the Voyager program was born, with a mission to explore the outer solar system like never before. Two spacecraft, Voyager 1 and Voyager 2, were meticulously designed and built. They were equipped with cutting-edge scientific instruments, cameras, and other tools to study the planets and their moons. The Voyager spacecraft were designed to be resilient, capable of withstanding the harsh conditions of space travel. The Voyager program aimed to greatly expand our knowledge of the outer solar system. Scientists were eager to study the gas, giant's atmospheres, magnetic fields and rings. They also wanted to learn more about the planet's mysterious moons. The Voyager missions were ambitious, pushing the boundaries of space exploration. They promised to deliver groundbreaking scientific discoveries and inspire generations to come. The Voyager missions were made possible by a rare planetary alignment that occurs only once every 175 years. This alignment allowed the spacecraft to use a gravity assist technique. By flying close to one planet, the spacecraft could use the planet's gravity to slingshot itself towards the next destination. This gravity assist maneuver saved a tremendous amount of time and fuel. Without it, the journey to Neptune would have taken 30 years. With the gravity assists, Voyager 2 could reach Neptune in just 12 years. The alignment of Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune in the late 1970s and early 1980s uh, presented a unique opportunity. NASA scientists and engineers seized this opportunity, designing the Voyager missions to take full advantage of this celestial alignment. The success of the Voyager missions is a testament to the ingenuity and careful planning of the teams involved. They recognized the rarity of the planetary alignment and crafted a mission that maximized its potential for scientific exploration. Voyager 2's first encounter was with Jupiter in 1979. It captured stunning images of Jupiter's swirling cloud tops, revealing the planet's dynamic atmosphere in unprecedented detail. The spacecraft also sent back close-up views of Jupiter's Great Red Spot, a massive storm that has raged for centuries. One of the most significant discoveries at Jupiter was the presence of active volcanoes on its moon Io. Voyager 2 observed nine volcanic plumes erupting from Io's surface, confirming it is the most volcanically active body in our solar system. These eruptions are thought to be caused by tidal heating from Jupiter's immense gravity. Voyager 2 also provided valuable insights into Jupiter's other moons. It captured images of Europa's icy surface, revealing a network of cracks and ridges that suggest the presence of a subsurface ocean. The spacecraft also observed Ganymede's massive size and Callisto's ancient crater terrain. The data collected by Voyager 2 at Jupiter revolutionized our understanding of this gas giant and its moons. The discoveries made during this encounter paved the way for future missions, such as the Juno spacecraft, which continues to explore Jupiter today. Section 4, Saturn's Majesty, Rings, Moons and Mysteries. In 1981, Voyager 2 reached Saturn, the ringed jewel of our solar system. The spacecraft sent back breathtaking images of Saturn's rings revealing intricate details and previously unknown structures. 
Voyager 2 discovered that the rings are composed of countless icy particles ranging in size from dust grains to small houses. Voyager 2 also made remarkable discoveries about Saturn's moons. It observed Titan's thick, hazy atmosphere, which is composed primarily of nitrogen. The spacecraft's instruments detected the presence of organic molecules in Titan's atmosphere, suggesting the possibility of prebiotic chemistry. The spacecraft also studied Saturn's moon Enceladus, observing its surprisingly smooth surface. Voyager 2's images revealed a network of cracks and fissures on Enceladus, hinting at the possibility of geological activity. Later missions, such as Cassini, would confirm the presence, the presence of active geysers on Enceladus spewing water vapor and organic molecules into space. Voyager 2's encounter with Saturn provided a wealth of information about this complex and captivating planet and its moons. The data collected by the spacecraft continues to be studied by scientists today, unraveling the mysteries of this gas giant and its intriguing satellites. Section 5. Uranus and Neptune Ice Giants Revealed Voyager 2's next encounters were with the ice giants, Uranus in 1986 and Neptune in 1989. These planets are much farther from the Sun than Jupiter and Saturn, and are composed mostly of ices like water, ammonia and methane. Voyager 2 provided our first close-up views of these distant worlds. At Uranus, Voyager 2 discovered a surprisingly bland atmosphere with few clouds. However, the planet's magnetic field was found to be tilted at an extreme angle, suggesting a complex internal structure. Voyager 2 also observed 10 new moons orbiting Uranus, adding to the planet's already substantial collection of satellites. Neptune, the most distant planet from the Sun, proved to be much more dynamic than Uranus. Voyager 2 observed a large dark storm in Neptune's atmosphere, similar in appearance to Jupiter's Great Red Spot. This storm of the Great Dark Spot provided clues about Neptune's turbulent atmosphere. Perhaps the most intriguing discovery uh, at Neptune was the observation of geysers erupting from the surface of its moon Triton. These geysers spew nitrogen gas and dust particles high above Triton's surface, creating a tenuous atmosphere. Voyager 2's observations of Triton provided valuable insights into the geology and atmospheric processes of this distant moon. The Voyager 2 encounters with Uranus and Neptune expanded our knowledge of the ice giants and their moons. The spacecraft's observations revealed a diverse range of features and processes, highlighting the complexity and wonder of these distant worlds. Section 6. Voyager 2 in Interstellar Space – A Continuing Journey In 2018, Voyager 2 crossed the boundary that marks the edge of the heliosphere. The bubble of charged particles and magnetic fields created by the Sun. This means that Voyager 2 is now officially in interstellar space, the vast region between the stars. Even though it is far from the Sun, Voyager 2 continues to send back valuable data. Its instruments are measuring the density and temperature of the interstellar medium, the gas and dust that fills the space between stars. Voyager 2 is also detecting cosmic rays, high-energy particles that originate from outside our solar system. These measurements are providing us with our first direct glimpse into the environment of interstellar space. This information is helping scientists to understand the nature of the interstellar medium and the processes that shape our galaxy. Voyager 2's journey into interstellar space 
is a testament to the incredible engineering and design of the spacecraft. It is a remarkable feat that a spacecraft launched over 40 years ago is still operational and returning valuable scientific data from such a distant location. Section 7 The Legacy of Voyager 50 Years of Discovery and Beyond As of March 2025, Voyager 2 has been exploring our solar system for almost 50 years. It has traveled over 12 billion miles from Earth, sending back breathtaking images and groundbreaking scientific discoveries. The Voyager missions have revolutionized our understanding of the outer solar system and inspired generations of scientists and engineers. The legacy of Voyager is one of exploration, discovery and human ingenuity. The spacecraft has pushed the boundaries of space exploration, demonstrating that we can send spacecraft to the farthest reaches of our solar system and beyond. Voyager 2 is expected to continue operating for several more years, sending back valuable data about the interstellar medium. Even after its instruments fall silent, Voyager 2 will continue to drift through the galaxy, carrying with it a message from humanity in the form of the Golden Record, a phonograph record containing sounds and images of Earth. The Voyager missions stand as a testament to the power of human curiosity and our desire to explore the universe around us. Voyager 2's journey of discovery continues to inspire us today, reminding us that the possibilities of space exploration are limitless.